So here's a one take low tech video just to explain to you the main features of the Big Bang and the steady state theories about the origins of the universe. So importantly it's not just about the Big Bang there is a competing theory called the steady state theory and that the competition was fairly fierce for many years and it really relies on evidence and you know observations and different types of evidence to be able to identify which of these theories is the most likely. So your assignment is going to involve looking at the pieces of evidence and matching that against your understanding of the two theories to work out which one of the theories is supported best by the evidence. So in a snapshot, the Big Bang Theory. Before the Big Bang, all matter and energy in the universe was compressed into a singularity smaller than one atom. And then at the time of the Big Bang, there was an explosive expansion and all matter and energy was released and has been expanding ever since. It started off as being a very exponential, a very rapid expansion and it's, whilst the expansion is slowed, it is still expanding. You need to understand that this is a snapshot here and it's the same all the way around. Um, so, it started off smaller than a speck and then a rapid expansion and it's been expanding ever since. So the Big Bang Theory states that the universe had an origin and that at once or was used, used to be more dense. So it was very dense when everything was packed in here and now over time the universe is expanding so the distance between all of these objects is actually increasing. The universe is becoming less dense over time. Let's compare that to the steady state theory, which says that the universe has always existed and will always exist. It says the universe is expanding, but the density of the universe does not change. And they s explain that by saying the hydrogen gas bubbles up into the universe. So a nice way to look at that is having a look at these two theories here, or these two diagrams. So evolutionary theory is another name for the Big Bang Theory. So when you're reading the Cosmic Times article, whenever it talks about evolutionary theory, we're talking about the Big Bang Theory. Okay, so let's have a look. Um, the evolutionary theory, the Big Bang Theory says the universe is expanding and it was once more dense and it's becoming less dense because it, can you see the distance between these galaxies if you like or particles is increasing so it becomes less dense whereas with steady state it says the universe has always existed and has always been of the same density but it is expanding so if it's expanding but it's the same density it must mean that new matter is being created and it suggests that it bubbles up into the universe. 